I ought to go back a little bit and and explain where the uh, where the name golden rice came from. Um, Ingo first presented these results at a meeting. Uh, it was actually the last meeting of the of the Rockefeller Foundation Rice Biotechnology Network held in Phuket, and it was one of several uh, important uh, scientific breakthroughs that were presented uh, at that at that meeting. Following the meeting, um, Bob Hurd, John O'Toole, and I stayed on in, in Bangkok. Uh, John was based in Bangkok and we needed to uh, spend a couple of days figuring out um, the, uh, the uh, next uh, phases of the work that, that he was going to be doing from that office. Uh, anyways, we wound up uh, having dinner one evening uh, with uh, a friend of John's uh, who's um, Mr. Michai. Mr. Michai in Thailand is the uh, head of a, of a big NGO and is famous for uh, disseminating condoms throughout uh, Thailand uh, that contributed significantly to, uh, to the population uh, stabilization programs in Thailand. But he distributed those condoms in, in very innovative ways. He, he had colored condoms. He, he gave away condoms if you bought uh, 10 liters of gasoline at, uh, uh, at the local gas station and the like. He made, it, he made it acceptable to be seen buying condoms and, and almost made it a treat. Uh, and so we were having dinner with him and, and uh, were just telling him of some of the exciting results. Uh, that had occurred at the meeting in Phuket and said to him, uh, you know, one of these is this new development uh, of yellow endosperm rice. And this rice produces beta carotene uh, in the endosperm. And he immediately recognized the importance of this because he'd been heading an NGO that had been dealing with vitamin A deficiency problems. Uh, and I can remember him saying, uh, you know, you Aggies, so he said, you don't understand marketing. You don't call this yellow endosperm rice. You call this golden rice. Uh, and he, uh, you know, he said, you, you've got to have a marketing campaign uh, behind this. You've got to make it a treat uh, to, to eat golden rice. It's got to be better uh, than white rice. So uh, we listened very intently, took his ideas. Uh, I can remember going back and telling Ingo, we've got to start calling this golden rice. And Ingo caught on immediately. Uh, and that's how the, how the name golden rice uh, uh, originated.